Okay, dear people, I have to show you what to do in Krita if you accidentally close all the toolbars because some people may not uh, find everything because it may take time. I will show you one trick what to do instead. You can still create your custom layout. I will even show you where is being saved. For example, I will mm, create complete workspace. You will still have on your local hard drive. When you go to username, also check application data um, uh, data. If you don't see this catalog, you have to go to folder options view, show hidden files, folders and drives. But I have set up already app data. To be visible, you go then to roaming uh, Krita, workspaces. Th this is our file which we have to copy. <coughs> D and then I have to check if I got on my local hard drive. Mm. Maybe I will create new catalog. Because I must show you if this will be possible, I believe it would be possible, especially when you install Krita from scratch. You may quickly load all settings. You do the same with color palettes. Okay, now I will show you what I must do. I will, I will close all toolbars. Hahaha, <laughs> looks strange. I know, looks strange and sad. Imagine how you can work now. Don't worry, we can still restore this. <laughs> I wouldn't work like this. Click on that. As you can see, this came up. Everything came up at once. You don't have to worry anymore. But make sure when you export your color palette, you have to select this, otherwise Krita might crash if you don't select one of the palettes. You can also change the name of the palettes. Krita... Mm. Sorry, I just feel a little bit tired. This will be our file which will be exported in a minute. A long time ago, Krita used to crash a lot. You do the same with color palette. You also do with brush presets. You also have to have copy of your brush presets. You copy all your brushes uh, to your external hard drive or partition. Okay, uh, uh, after when I showed you this, I I'm hoping that it would help you. You wouldn't have to go to settings, uh, dockers. You don't have to do that anymore if you use a workspace because it will make things easier for you. But please make sure you pay attention because you can still import palette from file 
Uh, I should really pay attention when I was exporting Corel Project. Oh yes, I got, like I just, I'm tired today, this is why I didn't really pay attention. But you can still import, but please, really focus on every single detail. We got this, but we don't have to import it, because I have already here only when you install Krita from scratch, you will have to import brushes, color alec, and even workspace file. Oh, I can show you now. But do that only when you have everything from the beginning. I hope you like this video.